we are simulating the entire career of Bronny James Jr. in NBA 2K25. So this is the official Bronny James here in NBA 2K25. So we're recording this on the first day, my second video of today. This is Bronny James Jr. So we're going to be simulating his entire career. Obviously, I'm getting drafted by the Los Angeles Lakers being a team with his pops, LeBron James. So we can see how this goes. He's probably not going to play immediately, but... Let's take a look at this rotation to see if Bronny's going to be in the game. So, D.O., Reeves, Hachimura, LeBron, A.D., Vando, Christie, Hayes, Wood, Vincent. And there's Bronny. He's 11th. So, for some reason, he's overcut that. I mean, I don't know why he's, you know, 11th, but that's a really good start. He's probably going to play in the G League year one, but we'll simulate the first season of Bronny James' career right now. At the end of the first simulation video of 2K25, Luka Doncic wins the MVP. Not expected. You know, Ronnie James didn't really play much his first year at all. He spent majority of his season in the G League, as you can see. Doesn't show, but he did, I guess, get caught up, like, at the very, like, at the end, second half of the season. But he did play some of the G League, as you can see right there. Um, so looks like, okay, so he only played three games in the G League for whatever reason. I think, like, really, he would be playing a day-to-day, -day, you know, starting role. But somebody only played three games. It's very weird, to say the least. But his first year, he's going to progress. And the Lakers did it. I missed in the playoffs. I mean, pretty badly. I mean, yeah, we were pretty we were pretty stinky, bro. 31-51 and 51 is insane. But, yeah, at least Brian James. I think LeBron might retire after this season. I'm not quite sure about that, though. As we have the Timberwolves going on to win it all. Ant Man on VP. Is his face scan looking better? Let me check. I just got to see his face scan, man. I haven't checked it. It seems like it's looking a little better. I uh, see. Anthony yeah, Edwards' face scan actually looks pretty accurate. 2K cooked. It's in the playoffs like that. LeBron James, Bronny James' father, will retire from the NBA. So now LeBron James has mentored Bronny for one year. Now he's out of the NBA. As he, obviously, he's retiring. So. Yeah, it's going to be out of the league. Chris Paul, Kyle Lowry, man, end of an era. Westbrook, bro, what an end of an era. But all these guys are retiring, so now Bronny James is now on his own. Into player progression here. The Lakers are now on the AD era. As AD is now their star player. Looks like we, they brought in some additions like in Steven Adams, Duncan Robinson. But Bronny James is up five overalls. He is now a 73 overall. So Bronny James could seek a day to day rotational role in the rotation. That's what I think. I think he could definitely play in the rotation now. Take a look at their shooting guard depth. He could start at point guard. We'll just have to see. Taking a look at Bronny News, he's going to start or not. So it looks like, oh, I didn't realize D'Lo was here. Wait, was he here the last time when I checked? Andrew Russell was not here the last time I checked, bro. Unless he signed, um, like, you know, out of free agency. He signed a three-year extension. So, I mean, D'Lo resigning could take up Bronny James' minutes. Bronny James, he is an urgency. That's a great start. So, Bronny James Jr. is seeking 10 minutes per game or 12 minutes, never mind, as a 10th man in the rotation. So he could definitely live up to that. Let's see. Austin Reeves will determine also if he will get plans. So Austin Reeves does have a player option. He will likely opt out of. So next year could be Bronny's year on the Lakers will be bad as well. He's probably going to get a lot of minutes this year. We'll see, though. Uh, is your back-to-back -back MVP. See, Flag is on the Philadelphia in the season for whatever reason. I know Wimby's also good in this game, man. Like, I don't really want to do it, a rebuild on him next. But the Lakers ended up, you know, not making the playoffs again, which does suck. Or the plan, they finish off to the 12th seed, 34 and 48 on the season. But let's see what Bronny James did this season with a rotational spot. AD was 25, obviously. D'Angelo the Russell, 20 points per game. So, looking at Nets, D'Lo, the sadly he's putting up on all these points in the trash. I don't know we were looking at per 36, not bad. Obviously, D'Lo is not averaging that much. So, yeah, he averaged only 20 points per game. Um, Okay, so, anyway, Bronny James, he averaged... Five points per game. Okay, that's a great start to his career. He shot about 32% from three. It's decent. It's decent. A little lot decent. Let's see. He played about 59 games. He started one game, which is interesting. Was he out of the rotation at one point? Looks like he was. So he's like in and out of the rotation, which is really weird. Next year's the year he'll 100% get a consistent role. Austin Reeves likely to probably leave this team. 
We'll just have to see, though, man, as we got the Mavericks won the championship. The Mavericks are the new Oklahoma City. It's always one team that's unstoppable in two games. It's looking like it's the Dallas Mavericks. The Thunder Loki are not good anymore. Thank goodness. I mean, obviously, it's not a good thing for Thunder fans, but I think Bonnie James will have a fair shot of getting playing time now that Austin Reeves will likely leave the team. Heading into player progression here. Reeves did it, and I'm coming back with a 2 He's a 79 overall. Bonnie James is a 77. We did sign Ben Simmons for whatever reason. Sam Hauser. But I said, Bonnie James is now the third rated shooting guard on this Lakers roster ahead of Max Christie. So, yeah, he could probably get more minutes. I would love for Reeves to not come back to the team. Bonnie James still has at least one more year left on this deal than a team option. Who oh, knew Wimby were going to be this good? Bro, 2K finally fixed him. Like, I absolutely love this, man. But, I right, so we got Bobby Clinton winning Rookie of the Year. So, yeah, my recording did low-key bug out. But if you want to see the rotation of how Bronny was playing. So, he was actually, he was coming off the bench. And he got inserted into the starting lineup. So, looks like Reeves actually was injured. Um, and then looks like we got Daniel Gafford and CM last time. So our team actually improved with Bronny James starting five. So he averaged about 10 points per game, four rebounds, three assists. He averaged 0. 0.6 steals per game, 0. 0.4 blocks, 1.5 turnovers, about 41% from the field at 33%. From three. He is improving really nicely into that 3 and D player. The entire not showing yet, but trust me, I think he can be that. So. We ended up being a playing team. We got the Phoenix Suns, so Booker, Trey, man, Royce O'Neal, Kevin Durant. They got Jabari at center. What? I mean, he is averaging 10 rebounds. Like, come on, Jabari Smith Jr. cannot play center. Let's see how this goes as we do end up winning. Now we have the Golden State Warriors. We beat this Warriors team as we win. Now we're in the playoffs. Oh, no. Yeah, we're close. We got to play one Binyama, bro. I never saw Stefan Castle's face game. Let's see how that one looks. Okay, Logic looks pretty good. 2K been nailing. He's face game, which is really cool. All right. I doubt, you know, Bronny and the Spurs could be, and Bronny and the Lakers could beat the Spurs team. We do push them to six. Wimby probably averaged like 40 on us, did he? Yeah, he averaged 35. And they fixed him really good. All right. So, um, and then we got the Cavaliers going on to win it all. Dude, Bronny ruptured his Achilles. What happened? Bronny, bro, wait, did he get injured during the playoffs? He did. So, we didn't even play that whole series. He played one game, dropped 20. And then he got injured. That sucks. But they are opting into his team option, which is amazing. Vanderbilt is uh, accepting. Christy is declining. Don Canet is back. So you can see how Bronny James develops in the offseason. I gotta say, I'm hyped to see because look like they're gonna start at a shooting guard, man. Heading into player progression. AD is down though. D'Lo is down. Canet is down. Max Christie is up two overalls though. We got Calvin Dixon going up six overalls. We got Austin Reeves going down, and then. Um, I, it's not showing, um, but he's all the way down, he's injured, but he is up to an 81 overall, so he is 100% going to start at shooting guard, unless they want to start Max Christie, though, which I hope they don't, um, actually, actually, Max Christie was pretty good for us, 11 points, 37% from three, honestly, if he keep this up off the bench, because I do want Bronny James to start, take a look at the FIBA World Cup thing, whatever, you can, whatever it's called, uh, here we go. We got the FIBA championship, man. It's every four years. Let's take a look at the teams. I just want to see. Can we even look at the teams? Uh, is it going to even let me? Wait, so, all right. So, we got Dyson Daniels. What is, what team is this? That Kyrie? Wait, so what team is this? I'm not, is this Canada? Wait, no, this is, a, okay, this is Australia versus, I don't know who these people are. But, you know, we could just see what happens anyway. Uh, see what happens as we got USA versus Canada. And then Australia versus France. Okay, that was Greece. So Giannis, I believe, should be on that team. Um, as he was. Yes, he was. All right. So I get it now. So every four years, this is the thing I was talking about, man, in my video. This is the thing I wanted, man. As we got Team USA beating Canada. And I expect, do Australia beat Team USA? No way. Johnny Furphy and Josh Giddy beat Team USA. Are we serious, dude? Team USA must be trash. Howie Bancaro. Man, we got Cooper Flag on here, bro. How did they lose? So, Bronny James is not starting at shooting guard. Oh, probably because he's injured. How long is he out for? Hopefully, it's not the season. That would suck. Okay, he's out for it, so he will return later, which sucks, man. Maybe I should turn the injuries off. Why did I listen to you guys, bro? Um, but, yeah, so maybe I should actually turn injuries off. Sally, is, is, scene is going to be derailed by that. 
He'll be back in four to six months. In the meantime, we can simulate to the end of the season. Also, before we continue the video, I just want to say make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. We've been uploading multiple 2K videos. I, this is my second one I record. At least maybe two more, maybe even one more. But since school is starting back tomorrow, I don't know how that's going to derail the channel or anything. But let's see if Ronnie Jane is back. Has it been four to six? It has. And, oh, bro, no way we picked up any dig and call a sex. And we are developing, bro. Bro, are we serious? We picked up two shooting guards. We might have to, we might have to slide Ronnie James the point guard. Because this is not looking too good. I mean, Ben Simmons is starting over Bronny, bro. Um, he's only getting 17 minutes. This, I, I mean, I don't want Ryan to leave the Lakers. No, I don't want him to win a championship. It's like his pops here. But space not, they're not really, you know, they're not using him well. I'm going to say that. But we'll see how the rest of the season goes. Let's see if Ronnie, did he sign an extension? I believe he's extension eligible. He didn't. Is he extension eligible right now? Because I think on the last year, are extension eligible as um it's probably not gonna let you know because he's not extension eligible never mind so for all this time so you guys at the end of the season Luka Doncic is your MVP we got some random guys in the rookie of the year at this point because the draft classes aren't even there um Wimby winning Kia defensive player but we ended up being the 10th seed again let's see Ronnie James is not starting Max still getting the starting spot but you can see how much he averaged at least that'll be cool Okay, Sexton was actually out in a sprained ankle, so I'm guessing that means, yep, he got an extended role. He averaged 11 points, 4 rebounds, 4 assists, about 1 steal a game, 42% from the field, and 35% from 3. Okay, Bronny is actually cooking, though. Um, let me see. I believe he has, a, like, good potential. I have to make sure, though. Like, I think we have to go to Vitro. Okay, so, um, potential. He has an 86 potential, which means he can develop to an 86 overall by the end of this day or higher. So they gave him a good potential, which is cool. So we're the 10th seed. We got Phoenix. We do end up winning. Now we got Oklahoma City as we do end up losing. So Ronnie James hasn't really had playoff success. And when he did get in the playoffs, he did get injured, which, you know, it sucks a lot. But, well, no, these are per 36. There's no way people are having that much. I... I don't know why I don't know why it does that, but the yeah, great dick got hurt. So how much Bronny average in the playing game? Like does he cook him twenty two points? Yeah, he cooks. So he just needs to be a day to day starting role, man. He can't get injured. No injuries need to happen. He does have an opportunity to leave Los Angeles if he really wanted to. We got Kevin Durant retiring. So yeah, he does have an opportunity to leave the Lakers, but I just really doubt he I just doubt he will, man. Um but you know, we'll check and see, right? So you know, player options, obviously it doesn't really matter, but we can head straight into the qualifying offer, so they will, ex wait, he's a free agent, just make it sure, right, he is a free agent, so I don't know why he's not a qualifying offer, which is weird, but looks like he just has to re sign huh, so alright, let's see what happens, Bronny James, a free agency, has zero offers, oh, he's asking for the bag, bro, he's asking for 37 million, I don't know if he's gonna get that much money, I'm not gonna lie, we'll see, it's average 11 points, a pretty good efficiency, Let's see what the Lakers plan to do on the Bronny James situation. So, Bronny James, the way I have an offer, they are renouncing the rights to Reeves, Vando, and Dalton Connect. This is not me controlling by the way, so you can't um, say that. So, uh, Bronny James still has offers. They're extending Dalton Connect now, but still no Bronny James extension, which obviously sucks on his part. But we can see at the end of free agency, see if he's going to get an extension or not. But right now, it's not looking like he's going to get one, man. Um, if he wasn't asking for so much, that I think he would eventually get one. But now it's one of the last day of friends. He's not having a single offer. How much is he asking for? Only twenty six million. I'll be. I'll probably be willing to pay that. But let's see what happens. As Bronny James does not resell with the Los Angeles Lakers. Bronny's gonna take his talents to Milwaukee and join Triple J. I don't really know how I feel about this, man. We'll see how it goes, though. All right, so Bronny James is having the starting shooting guard role finally. So maybe it was a good decision for him to actually leave Los Angeles and go to Milwaukee off the starting role. He wasn't he wasn't bad by any means in LA, but now you know he could be able to stat pad. Uh, look at it, bro, because this team is stinky, bro. This team is not good. So really, he could put up really good numbers in this fifth year of the NBA. We'll see though. All right, man. Wimby is already making his case for the GOAT because there's no way. At 25 years old, this man has already won two MVPs, five Defensive Player of the Years, 
five first team all NBA. Like this, dude. Like, there's no way this guy is not the goat by the end of his career. It's insane. But we finished off with the nice season. So we were just a little better, which is nice. I mean, we're not the Lakers anymore, man. I still, you know, we're not the Lakers. So, with a box size. Yeah, we're not in the playoffs. So, man, I would love for him to join an actual good contender team. Because these teams are so bad. 30 and 52. Okay, the last team in the um the East, obviously. I guess we can add a guy in, like, the draft. But, like, it's not what I'm looking for at this point. 2K first started. So, all right. So, Ron Morrison, like, okay, no, this is per 36. We have to look at per game. Thank you. Go back to five points per game. All right. We had 19 from Jamal. We had about 17 from Triple J, 17 from AJ Johnson. Honey James, the guy we're obviously um, simulating, had about 14 points, five rebounds, five assists, a steal per game, shot and shooting 47% from the field and 39% from three. This is what you love to see. A true 3 and D player, right? You still didn't get the full shooting guard role for whatever reason. But so he's still developing. You know, it's going to be a while before, you know, if, if he even becomes a superstar. And then 2 gets 23 the fire I used to use. He'd always become a stud. But um, we got Jer Jeremy Grant following it up on the Lakers. Yusuf Nurkic retiring. But yeah, my name is a free agent. Once again, he did only sign a one-year deal with the Bucks, so he will be a free agent. Once again, we can head straight to freaking see now and see where Brandon is going to. I feel like he upped his value up a lot to maybe get a contract like that as he's not under bird rights, which means he was beyond a strict free for a team to sign him. So let's see if he has any, you know, offers. That Cam Christie, he is 84 overall. Wow. Literally drafting like the end of the second round. That's crazy. But anyway, Brandon James does not have an offer, so. I might just have to wait and see what team he goes to. He just re with the Milwaukee Bucks. Interesting. I didn't even see it, but he re with the Milwaukee Bucks. So now he is a Milwaukee Buck for three more years, was looking like. So we can see what happens. Let's take a look at his contract details. So uh, BJJ, let me see. Contract. Is there a way to... Okay, yeah, he's making $26 million and then $29 million at that. The contract will be a free agent at the 27 which is cool. So let's see how much he progresses. He should actually progress like a lot. Hopefully that's the case. We'll see. So player progression. Yeah, Ronnie James going up one overall. So at the end of the season, another year we didn't make the playoffs again. We just missed as the 11th seed. As Ronnie James Jr. averaged about 13 points, five rebounds, four assists, 36 with seven from three. So it's probably not gonna be nothing more than this. You know, average role play, which is fine. He's improving every year. Um, this is a this is a better year. I I you know you, and I say it, this is a better year. So. Um, like I said, it's another year I'm missing the playoffs, another year of the Bucks. You know, this suck, man. I want to join a good team. Why couldn't we be in Detroit? I know it sounds crazy now. But why couldn't we be in Detroit, man? Man, Brownie fumbled. All right. We got DeRozan retiring. But, yeah, we can have Shane to play a progression, and he should be progressing really nicely. He is now almost the best player on the team with Triple J progressing down to an 86 overall. Bronny is the second best player in being 85. I wonder what his shot tendency is. I might actually push that up to 60. No, we're pushing up to, like, a 70. I want him to take a little bit more shot. Maybe, like, a 69 is cool or a 70. I want Bronny to take just 10% more of the shots he was taking before. That is not really that much. So with 10 boosts for Bronny, I'm giving him the keys. We're not really the key. I mean, definitely give Triple J the score. So, yeah, we can see how this goes. As last He's obviously going to start. But we'll just see how many, you know, his numbers. Right now, he's actually decent. His bucks aren't really. So at the end of the season, we actually finished off not making offs again. I, mean, I just want, want to get a ring in Bronny in his career. But... He ended up averaging spread 36. He ended up averaging. Maybe I should go to the to click his player. I'm going to just do that. It's way too much, man. All right. So, Ronnie Names averaged about 15 points per game, five rebounds, four assists, almost a steal per game, 37% for three. Really decent, man. Like, he up. Just the value you can offer to like an actual good team. Pretty sure he only has one more year left on this deal. Or is this the year he's a free agent? Oh, he has one more year. Yeah, one more year left on this deal. We're almost out of here, man. I traded a player on the, on the box. We got Case and Wallace now. So we now have a Case and Wallace and Bronny front court. So that honestly should, or back court, as I should say. So that should be a pretty interesting um, defensively, defensively as well. Case and Wallace with average two steals a night. And then this team actually improved a bit. Like, I can't lie, it improved a little bit. So maybe it's not the worst thing in the world, but the only on team is still bad. We got Miles Bridges. We got freaking. I don't even know, man. Uh, the team, we improved a bit, but the team is still pretty bad.
think it's possible for a team to be this bad in the span of four years. No, it's not even been four years on a three-year contract. It's been four years. We haven't made it not one time. Like, actually, this is getting insane, bro. Ronnie James averaged 12 points, five rebounds, four assists. You know, nothing too crazy, but, like, come on, man. We need to start, we need to, we need to start winning games. This sucks, man. It really does actually suck. Watching where it's going to win it all. All right, so finally we're getting out of this freaking Milwaukee place, bro. We're getting out of the Bucks. We're getting, hopefully at least, that's the case. Hopefully he doesn't need to be signed. And Bronny, wait. Wait, what happened? Did he actually sign an extension? Dude, I'm out, bro. He signed an extension with this trash. Horrible team. Until he's 31. He'll be afraid when he's 31, man. Well, with this team, four more years. Let's keep going. Huh. Actually improved this season as of the fifth seed. So yeah, we were honestly really good. Honey James averaged about okay, so I can lie, he averaged about thirteen points, five rebounds, five assists, and a steal per game. With a great and good efficiency. So you know, on, on, obviously these aren't pretty numbers. These are average role player numbers, but you can't lie, dude. Being six three and averaging almost six boards per game is amazing. Like they could got like who who was six three, I doesn't really rebound too much, so like and I and I like I wanted to say like shape rebounds. Um, I don't know. Somebody just doesn't a small guy doesn't really rebound too much. Like you could argue Trey Young. He's a little taller than Trey Young, I think so. But you know somebody here, Trey Young, he doesn't rebound. So I mean that could be an option, but he's a little taller than Trey. But like I said, being and anyway, is being drafted the fifty fifth overall pick in the draft and still becoming a rotational really good role player piece is insane. He said he wanted to you know be like Davion Mitchell, Derek White. I believe there's somebody else as well, and he's definitely passed Davion Mitchell, and he is kind of in those Derek White conversations as the fifty fifth overall pick. Imagine drafting Derek White with the fifty fifth overall pick in the draft. Absolutely insane. Shout out to Brian James, man. But now we have the Bucks have the Indiana Pacers. As we do end up getting, you know, we end up losing seven. All right, that's fine. At least we made the playoffs. But yeah, shout out to Bronny James, man. We got the Wizards around one. Um, I actually know the Wizards are going to win the championship. This freaking super team, bro. Um, the Spurs with Wimby Nama lose. Wimby's a 97 out of 25 at night. He is 29 at this point. So the guys are getting older. We go on to the point where somebody's considered a young star in the NBA. Jalen Brown. J I mean, my bad. Jalen Brunson has retired. Max, bro, what are we doing? You're 30 and an 81 overall. Why did you retire? You were having a great season. And we got Ronnie James still has 80. So that's, that's his max potential, which I'm honestly not mad at. Great. He's 28 years old at this point. He's kind of still in his prime. But he is getting a little older. So we'll see if he ever gets a ring, if he ever leaves this team, bro. The end of this season. Now, we end up. Wait, are we not in? Oh, we didn't make the play. Again. If I think we got to force Brian to leave the boss, like this is just wasting his talent and his career at this point. He was coming off the bet. Yeah, nah, now nah, we're getting out of Milwaukee. I'm sorry, bro. Ronnie put up great numbers again. Now nah, we're getting out of Milwaukee, man. It's not happening. We're we're forcing them out. And once the contract ends, we're forcing them out. Sick of just not winning anything. Like, when will we ever get a chance to just make the playoffs and have a good playoff? Ron, one I'm still, you know, absolutely demolishing that NBA. But he is now on a two year deal. He'll be afraid. And I said at the age of 31, he's 29, kind of in the middle of his prime. Now we're going to go straight to player progression again. And hopefully, this team can at least get some random auto generated 99 overall player. With how many years we've been so bad, we should have cap space. But we'll see what happens. As nope, we didn't do a single thing in the offseason. I mean, John Mullen, whoever you are, you look like you're. Putting up some decent numbers, but that's it. We didn't do anything. When will we ever? When will we ever realize we're wasting a, the goat son career? See, man, if the Nuggets can win seventy six games, like, are we serious? Seventy six, dude. They must be trying the eighty two and zero challenge. There's no way this team, but like, man, two kid, man. Dude, we 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 got to get the draft classes in soon because this is just too many auto generated, bro. We gotta, gotta get the draft classes in soon. It just has to happen very soon. But now we got the now we ended up being the fifth, fourth seed and find a freaking league. We were actually a contender. So I think James averaged about 15, but like, this is basically the same stat you're gonna see throughout his entire career, which isn't bad. Can we beat Atlanta though as we get eliminated in five games? 
Um, how many more years left? This is one more year left. One more year left for this to win on. And join the Nuggets, bro. Like, come on, man. I don't care if you're coming off the bench. Join this team. Join the 80 to win challenge. Because there ain't no way, bro. Booker stayed loyal to Phoenix was there his whole career. Donovan Mitchell was a free agent after getting traded. RJ Barrett is in Indiana retired. DeAndre E and out of the league retiring. Zion Williamson with the Lakers retiring. We got Devin Vassell retiring as a spur. Triple J. He was just with us, but he retired. Um, I guess we traded him. I don't even know. But why straight make sure he's not at his ass what I'm not talking about. So we'll just see again what this team has in store for us, what this team can provide for Bonnie James last year as a buck. Because we're getting the freak out of here, man. Same, man. Just saying how these simulations just go downhill. And for some reason, the players just love to stay here. They sign extensions. We got to be realistic, man. Brian James, 86 overall. His physics is going down. Physical is going out. Just isn't a really good sign, Um, obviously. But his three points is going up. Mid range is going up, which is cool. And then, obviously, the team still sucks. Another consecutive year with a fourth seed. Honestly, I don't really see us beating any team in the playoffs. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what we expect. Brown is out of here. I just want to see the little Brown win. Like the Nuggets. This is not Nicole Jokic, but we've been past that era. We're in the Cameron Christie era. As Shea is retiring, man, he's at 94. Ja. Ooh, all these players are young, like really young, and they're retiring. Like, there's any rookies that retired? Like, take a look. Jacoby Walters retiring. At the age of 30. No, this is weird. He must have had a career ending injury. Maybe we should turn injuries off. But Le 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 you know, LeBron James Jr. is a free agent. We can see how that works. So, as yeah, he didn't resign, right? It's making sure. No way. I made sure to put that off. He did not resign. He did not resign. No, he didn't. Wait. Is he here? Or he's not. Is he must have not the bird rights. Okay. Ryan Jr. is right here. He got. Wait. He got. Yo, I didn't even see he got traded. Who traded Bronny? Dude, there's no way they actually got rid of Bronny James. Man. They, I didn't even realize he got traded. That's my bad. Man. I didn't even know he got traded. Who got him? Um, No, I saw the Kings got him, but what did they trade him for? They must, no, there's no way. I didn't even realize I should pay more attention. He got traded, bro. He got traded for Willis Greeny in a second. There's no way, man. Who is Willis Greeny? We traded him for a 30-year-old 86 overall. Uh, auto, we we traded Bronny for auto generated play. What, what what can I say, man? He's in. I mean, he's not in Sacramento anymore. Sacramento didn't win the championship, obviously, but now he's a free agent, man. I didn't even know he got traded. We can see where he goes now. I mean, he's a little older. His value will be a little bit down as he's going to sign a five year deal with the Sacramento Kings. He's going back to Sacramento, which is interesting, man. Making sure he doesn't follow the free agency. Nah, he's going back to Sacramento, man. So that's cool. Sacramento's team. We got Stanley, Grant, Taylor. Bro, where's Bronny, bro? Dude, there's no one. Where is he now? Dude, this guy keeps bouncing around. Where is he at now, man? No, I got to look at this again. Because I'm pretty sure he's out with the Kings. Oh, no, he's a free agent. What happened? I would make sure he didn't follow the free agency. It looks like he's gone. He's a free agent. They renounced him? What happened? I thought they re-signed him. I'm honestly confused, bro, but it's it's fine. We can see. He, there's no way he just doesn't get picked up, right? There's no way LeBron James' son doesn't get picked up, right? There's no way, right? We have to see. Uh, he's still a free agent. That's crazy, man. I mean, the, apparently the Kings, wait, can the Kings get him? Can they really get him? Um, No, they they can't. So, wow, he's still afraid. And we can see where he signs, though. Simulated, like, a couple of weeks, like, November or something. But is he signed now? Like, there's no way. Is he? Okay, he's signed now. But where do he sign to? I uh, see. He, now, hopefully, it's a contender. I don't care. Hopefully, it's a contender, though. But let's see. So, Brian James Jr. did end up signing with, I just saw his name. He ended up signing with the San Antonio Spurs. We're with Wimby. This team, bro, we got Lavelle. He's probably old. Yeah, Unc, bro. We got Ronnie, 32. We got their wife, Scotty Barnes, another old Unc. We got Wimbenyama here. He's 32, but he's still productive. I'm so oh, I got to play Wimbenyama. So we have a duo of Ronnie James and Wimbenyama together. This is probably a championship team, at least hopefully. I don't know what's down at four, but he's our teammate. He's now on another deep boy. Does it show? Is this his 100th defensive? This is an 11th deep boy. Are we serious? 11 defensive. That's obviously the record. 
But come on, there's no way. We're the third seed. We're finally playing some contending basketball. We're back. Ronnie's back in the West. We're finally out of the Ronnie out of Milwaukee, man. Ronnie James he doesn't have an award yet, but hopefully he can end up with a with the ring, right? So a championship. So yeah, I was 13, five and five, one steal, three service. Just the you know, he just fits right into the puzzle in the, in this team, which is amazing. So can we beat the Grizzlies in round one? We beat them in six. They had obviously a really good team, but now we got Golden State. Dude, why is every single team basically a freaking super team, bro? Like, we can see what happens, but we didn't want to have losing in five. Man, I thought that was the year, but sadly, it's not going to be. Uh, it's not retiring, right? Oh, it's retiring. You're a point guard, bro. Come on. Got to watch. is just gone. Walker Kessler is gone. Luca's out of the league now, and he's retired at an 82 overall. Interesting. Ben Pajemski, Zach Eady. We got... I mean, a lot of guys, not the lead. JT Dore, Taylor Hendricks, man. A lot of guys retiring. But that means, wait, what country did he sign? That means Ronnie James is a free agent again. So we have to go back to free agency and see where LeBron James Jr. himself signed. Um, you guys want to see a Bryce James career in the radio free simulation next? Make sure to let me know. But he's not even in the... I mean, he's not even in a 2K right now because of the draft classes. So we got people asked for 72 million, insane. But let's see where the obviously Bronny James will go. Um, as right now he doesn't have an offer, 87 overall, still productive. We can see where he ended up going. We can skip past Monitorium. Did he sign? Uh, 87 overall. Looks like he did sign with the team. Okay, and he ended up signing. No, he did not sign with the team. I will keep live. Wow, LeBron James Jr. is out of the league. That's insane. So, see where he signs. Ended up signing with the Magic. Okay. So, at the end of the season, you think I'm not making the playoffs? Honestly, I mean, we ended up playing a team, but what likely? Yeah. I mean, huh, I mean, I mean James Jr., average about 12 points, 5 rebounds, 5 assists, 40% from deep, 48% from the field. Another amazing season, dude. This talents are going to waste. So far, he's accomplished basically nothing in his NBA career, but, you know, it's not technically over yet. He's going to be afraid for the, for, for again, he's going to be afraid. This is Colin Murray. Yeah, yeah, this is Colin Murray, I guess. Wow, cool. But, all right, going to be afraid again, unless he didn't call a quit. I mean, I don't think he did. Did he? I mean, there's really no point of showing checking at this point. He probably most likely did. Yeah, he's still, still playing. All right. Uh, okay, so here we go. So, heading. Into free agency once again. Um, let's we really have a 99 overall here. That's it's insane. He's only average 13 points. Please, man, these drive classes gotta come very soon. But all right, um, 30. Okay, so right now that's for 39 million, and he doesn't have an offer. Shaden Sharp is here as well. Don't know what happened out, but whatever. Um, okay, let's wait to see. If he doesn't have an offer again, man. He's hurry up and retired because I don't think he's gonna get anything in this career. Thing, honestly, too, man. Um, okay, they have his cap holes. We can just do like this and see when he gets in, when what team he signs with, even if he does, because the Magic are not going to bring him back. Wow. I mean, he's going to be another, going to be a free agent again. So he's going to be unemployed for a, another offseason. Interesting. So let's see if he's actually a free agent, though, man. This is upcoming free agents. We have to see if he's a free agent by doing the player finder. There's a couple ways to do this, but. Oh, it's just going to take too long. Why not? I don't know, man. I don't know what just happened. But what is shooting guards? We'll see if he's actually unemployed or not. As BJJ is um unemployed. Ended up joining the Grizzlies on another one-year deal. Honestly, this is getting really annoying. But see if we can even win anything. Okay, we get into the playoffs. No, we can't. <laughs> this is terrible. This is not a good career simulation, is it? Not at all. Not a single thing accomplished. Not a single NBA Finals reach. Not a single conference finals reach. Like it's it's as bad. It's it's not good. It's really not a good look by any means. But if he retires and we can get this over with so he can stop signing one year deals. No, he's still gonna play. Why why, why do I think he's gonna retire? It's Bronny James. Why do you retire? Alright, so now we can see what's going to happen with his free agency for the like, 100th and 100th time. Uh, wait, where is he? Okay, he's right here. Uh, so we can see what happens to him. Is he, yep, he has a cap hold. We're going to see where, if he even signs with somebody or not. 
No, he's probably not, but I'll just let you guys know if he doesn't help anybody. But, bro, Wemby is one to deploy every single time. But, Johnny James, I'm going to Minnesota on a minimum, dude. I'm really getting tired of this minimum contract thing. At least sign a bigger deal. But, so on the minimum contract with the Timberwolves now, he has another shot of winning a championship. So, we're going to beat Portland around one. We're going to do, is this the year, is the year we beat the, no, we're not beating this team, bro, like. I don't get out so many. We, I mean, we're playing with Ant, so Ant and Bronny now together, which is cool. Anthony Edwards is still at 94. Okay? See how this goes against Utah. We're in the finals. It's just the year, just the year, just the year, bro. Oh, I think this is the year. This team is low-key. Made all the other teams I saw. Game one, we're going to take. Game two, we're going to take. Game three, they're going to take. Game four. Oh, come on, man. I'm going to have to simcast this one. Game Six really important game. Are we gonna go up three to two on the New York Knicks? If we do, that's huge. If we don't, then we're cooked. As we're gonna go up three to two on the Knicks, just like that. Honey James with nine points. But here we go. Can we go ahead and advance? I'm not even advance. Win the NBA Finals, man. Come on. All right. So the Knicks have the lead right now, and it looks like I hope so. As we're gonna you know, choke the game seven. All right. So going to a game seven now. Please, dude. I, I need at least one brownie ring. If we can get one ring, I'll st I promise you I'll stop and claim for the rest of the video. It's a close game. Come on, Minnesota. Get back in. Back into the game, man. Get back into the game. It's a minute left. I'm hopping in. We are hopping into the basketball. First hop, the game of the NBA 2K24. Scoreboard looks crisp. Um, I don't know. And, okay, that's Anthony Edwards. Never mind. Anthony Edwards. Ant with the ball. Anthony Edwards trying to drive inside. And... Get stopped. Ant will take the lay. Ant will miss it. Ooh, come on, man. Pass the ball. I know, I know, but come on, man. Like at least Ron Ronnie's not in the game. Yeah, he's in the game. Number twenty-four. Wow. But um, show numbers. Kobe, cool. But um, all right. So we got Clemens with the three. He's gonna shoot it. And he's gonna. I'm out of here. Dude. I know with a little bit of hopping game, we can't freaking win a championship. After what I just saw, man, this 2K of 25 isn't even a good game. What I just freaking saw made me not want to hop into a game ever again. That was terrible, bro. Can't get a championship in the game. Seven. And after that, retire. Yeah, bro. Unk had to retire, bro. After he sold after he sold that ring, yeah, he immediately caught a quit. But since Bronny's still playing, we yes, we still gotta do this, man. Like, how old is he at this point, man? I believe he's like 36. I can't even check. I mean, we can see how old he is for a second. As Bronny is, no way he actually retired. No, we're in a small four, so he did not retire. Trust me. Yeah, he's 35. Then he's probably not gonna have a team, so he might as well just go what we did before. Or he may even make the playoffs, man. I mean, this year retires just for a long time. Oh, he says he's gonna retire. Maybe this is the year we finally stop signing minimum contracts. And we got the Blazers winning the championship, whatever. Let's see if he's there selling the truth. Yes, Brian retires as a Detroit Piston. This career, like, how many teams have he joined? So the Lakers, the Bucks, the Kings, three, Spurs, four, five, six, seven, eight. He joined eight teams this whole entire career. Played 17 seasons, tried at 36. And this is the end of Bronny James's career. I don't think he was up there for like the accolades or anything, but we'll check and see. Obviously, so NBA records, um, total points scored in the game now goes to Anthony Edwards. But yep, yeah, LeBron James still owns that. You know, Dewey Bar, Carl Malone, um, <clears throat> Anthony Edwards. So yeah, I don't really, I don't, I don't expect to see Bronny James Jr. But if you guys spot him, which I did not spot him anywhere in the top 100. Which sucks for him, but that's how we're gonna end this one off today. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Um, he officially retired July third, twenty forty one. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.